Now, for the record, the other day I had saved a bunch of comments from Masika Kalisha's Instagram page, and I'm going to do another video with those comments that I saved, and I might even take some more screenshots of some new ones. It's going to be a super long video, probably 20, 30 minutes, maybe a little longer, and I'm going to really dig into the meat and the potatoes of what she said and why people need to get over it and not be mad at her, and this is just another chapter in the hashtag war on pretty. Shout out to TMZ. They did an interview with the beautiful Masika Kalisha from Love & Hip Hop. They titled their article, remember, I'm gonna do a longer video about this, but for now, let's just talk about this TMZ interview and their article. It was posted October 22nd of 2019, and it's titled, Love & Hip Hop star Masika Kalisha, I don't want my kid to see PDA, and it's not just Disney. Basically, PDA is a public display of affection. Basically, there was some advertisement, if I'm not mistaken, for, I guess, a Disney movie and two male, kiss, two male characters kissed each other and Masika did not feel comfortable with it. And she said something about it online. She doesn't want her three year old <laughs> Kari Barbie Maxwell. Yes, from Kari Barbie Beauty, the daughter that she had with Fetty Wap and she made the beauty care line, like named the beauty care line after. E yes, her daughter. And she doesn't want her three year old seeing people kissing and stuff like that she doesn't want her seeing that crap and now people were basically saying so saying in so many words that she's a quote-unquote homophobe but she doesn't want anybody kissing and being affectionate so-called uh, displaying that type of stuff on tv or around her three-year-old at all hashtag war on pretty Here's the teams he wrote. ex loving hip hop star Mas Masika Kalisha is taking her crusade. R d just look at the language from the beginning. Very incendiary. Very sneaky. ex loving hip hop star Masika Kalisha is taking her crusade against sexuality and children's programming one step further. She doesn't want her kid to see PDA anywhere. Masika, who has a little girl with Fetty Wap, joined us on Team Z Live Tuesday for an interesting discussion on parenting, defending her Instagram rant against Disney shows and movies showing PDA of any sort, be it hetero or homosexual. She insists her stance is in no way anti-LGBTQ. Instead, Masika says she's trying like hell to shield three-year-old Kari Barbie from all signs of affection, even in real life. She says she's not okay with Kari even seeing parents kiss goodbye and doesn't allow any friends visiting her house to kiss in front of her daughter. The way Masika sees it, she should be allowed to guard her kid from cursing, kissing, and alcohol in any way she sees fit. And she's got loads of issues with the content <laughs> with the content kids are consuming from a young age. Then they posted Fetty Wap's video for Trap Queen. It says, sounds like little Kari won't be watching dad's music videos anytime soon. TMZ. Why would Kari be watching the got daggone trap uh, trap queen video? Just like why would she be watching Love and Hip Hop? Why would she be watching that Playboy thing that Masika Kalisha had shot back in the day? <laughs> I know I watched it, but I'm a grown man, so it's okay that I watched it. <laughs> and y'all know I'm one of Masika's biggest fans out here. <laughs> See, I watched it quite a few times. Uh, <laughs> um, and, and, and yeah, she she didn't have nothing on, and it, it was oh, it was good TV. Oh, so good. Um, but back to the subject again. So, so what, did, what, did, what did Masika say that riled people up and got people so mad? Like I said, I'm going to make a longer video about it, you know, where I'm really going to dig all up in it. Where I'm going to get to those crazy comments that people were leaving. People were basically talking to so many words about canceling Bay. So, you know, I'm 100 percent not here for the foolishness. You know, long live Masika. Masika is here forever. Cardi B voice. OK. Hold up. If you want me to talk, all you got to do is say something. No, Cardi, please shut up. Get off my video. This video is not about you. Don't ruin my video. Have some respect for the great Masika Kalisha and them cheeks. All right. So what did Masika say? Bay said it's not about homosexuality or heterosexuality. From the beginning, 
it's not about homosexuality or heterosexuality. Stop promoting sexuality to our children, period. Let kids be kids. There's nothing wrong with her saying that. And, and look at it from the beginning. It's not about gay anything. So they're letting people know, like, nobody's anti-LGBTQ over here. Nobody's anti ligabatiqua LGBTQ. I hope I said that right. Anyways, this is for the fools that think it's, quote, progressive when Disney has a gay couple kissing next to Nemo. No. Hashtag KB or Kari Barbie ain't watching Adam and Eve in sexual situations. The hell you think I'm supposed to let her watch Adam and Steve lip lock it for? It's not progressive. It's suggestive. And I suggest you let a child be the child. Now, Jesus, once again, let me reread a part of that. No, Kari Barbie ain't watching Adam and Eve in sexual situations. In other words, if it's a male and a female, she's not down for it. And she's not going to let it go down if it's uh, same gender, same sex couple, whatever. It doesn't matter. She doesn't want her three year old watching <laughs> the fact that. And you know who they got reading to the kids in school, but yeah, let me take another sip of this, this, this coffee. Let me. All right, y'all. Anyway, stay tuned for my long epic video. You're gonna make you want to make sure you click the subscribe and the notification bell. Click all notifications. Come back to my channel. Click the videos tab because I post a bunch of new videos every single day of the year, including holidays with plenty of videos about Masika Kalisha because I think that Masika Kalisha is the second coming. But anyways, now nah, I'm just I'm just messing it up. But she she is all that though. But uh Bay didn't say anything wrong. As usual Masika was on point. I be co-signing all of her BS. Except for when she has beef with hate except for the beef with Hazel that won't go away. That's the only thing that I don't co sign Masika on. That's the only thing that I I was, I was mad at Masika about. But anyways, uh, Masika has every right to judge what goes on in her household. In the future, uh, people like Masika are going to be considered extremist. And uh, people like her are going to have like uh, electric shock collars. Did anybody ever see that movie from back in the day called Deadlock where they had those people with the collars on their necks? And if they tried to take it off, I, their heads would explode in the movie, right? Anyway, that was a movie from way back in the day. I ought to watch that movie again. That was a crazy picture. But in the future, people like Masika Kalisha uh, aren't going to be allowed to, uh, to parent properly. They're not going to be allowed to judge what goes on in their household. They're going to essentially be told from the beginning that their child has to view stuff like that because of the simple fact that there are people with an extreme agenda who they feel like by any means necessary, they must promote this agenda. And there's this huge lie about black people, black Americans specifically being anti LGBTQ or ligabataqua. Like even Tank said something about it recently because Tank, I, I separate videos coming about this or they might be up before this one. I don't know which order I'm going to post them in because I'm about to do those videos like pretty much right after this. But Tank had basically said that if a man goes down on another man two times, he's not gay. He was basically seeing whether or not he liked doing it. So, uh, you know, I, I didn't hear the whole lip service interview with Angela Yee and her girls. But I hope that he said he was just joking after saying that because he just sound like a, cr a crazy person, basically. But I, I mean, sugar in his tank is going to uh, anyway, I, I, I'll go in and on tank. Well, he would like that. I'm going to say some crazy things about tank and tell some funny jokes and stuff when I tear tank. A new, no, no, he would like that. I went when I when I when I go at tank for him being a clown. But anyway, shout out to Masika. Bay. you said nothing wrong. As always, you're always on point. Beautiful, intelligent. Hard working, the woman's just everything. I gotta go, y'all. I gotta go. I think I'm gonna go and chill at Masika's Instagram for a little while, go admire her and all that perfection. Um, but anyways, shout out to Masika for once again, you know, spreading knowledge and and teaching people something because there's a lot of dummies out here. And honestly, we, we need to be a lot more like Masika. And the, it, it, there were more people like men and women like Masika, the, the world would just be a better place because. Masik is just awesome. But anyways, let me know what y'all think about it below. Do you agree with her statements? Do you disagree? And why? Don't just say you disagree for no reason. Uh, you know, like, make sure you you explain why 
and, and pretty much this is just another case of the hashtag war on black Americans and the WOBA <laughs> war on black Americans and you know people trying to paint black people as homophobes when she clearly said it's not about homosexuality or heterosexuality that was literally the first thing that she said but yet they still turn into a racial issue and stuff like that and went around attacking Bay because that's just what it, that's just what ignorant people do. Look at me. I'm stuttering talking about other people being ignorant. But anyways, let me know. <laughs> let me know what y'all think about it below. Me Magazine on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, MeWe. Me Magazine blog on Instagram. Click the thumbs up button. Subscribe. Thumbs up. Comment subscribe and click that notification bell click all notifications come to my channel click the videos tab see what you've been missing if you don't get a million plus notifications every single day of the year i post new, new videos all the time and, and a lot of times i talk about masika because masika stays doing big things about as big as her booty and that's pretty big you dig and i, I just love everything i love everything the sister does i, I love masika y'all know that so th th this is a very extremely pro masika channel so you you know I agreed with her from the beginning. So I don't know why y'all playing like you didn't know what time it was. Like y'all didn't know whose channel you were at. Okay? Anyways, I gotta go, y'all. Shout out to Masika. Me Magazine.